Did he show? No. What if he doesn't come? It's no big deal. I'll tell the story. Did he really start a fight in school? All I know is something happened and he got sent to the principal. I bet he's grounded. What a jerk. Why did he start a fight? And that's the kind of thinking that makes me nuts. What, you what did you do? I know Tough you did. Whoa, 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 whoa. How come whenever something nasty goes down, I take the heat? It's like I'm guilty till proven innocent. Because you're usually guilty? No. Just because somebody does some things sometimes doesn't mean he does everything all the time. Forget it. All right. I got a story about this very thing. It's about a guy who's a little different. He doesn't go along with what's normal, you know? People don't like things that aren't normal. It makes them uncomfortable. But that's the way my guy likes it. That is, until he gets into trouble and he has nowhere to turn. And the only person who believes in him is the one person he should fear the most. Somebody for the approval of the Midnight Society. I call this story The Tale of Vampire Town. Funeral home. Oh, hi, honey. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on my way. No. No, I won't forget the milk. Yeah. See you soon. in Wisteria, the fabled vampire town. Only last week there was a vampire attack in this quiet hamlet. Could it be that Dreyfus, the greatest vampire of all, has returned? Legend has it that he slept in the catacombs beneath Wisteria for centuries. If this is true, and he has indeed risen from his grave, I will do everything in my power to meet him, face to face. Dad, take it easy. I, I mean, Father, please take care. Sorry, Mr. Lugosi. Lunchtime. You know I only eat red meat. Yeah, peanut butter sticks to the fangs. If I'm going to hunt vampires, then I need to think like a vampire. And I don't think that they eat peanut butter. Wisteria, one mile. You sure you want to go to this place? I mean, uh, I got field seats for the Jets game tomorrow. Honey, this is Adder's call. Yeah, but field seats. This is a family trip. We agreed as a family to let Adder choose the place. Yeah, yeah. Transylvania, here we come.
This is the place? Just as I imagined it. Better have cable. Oh, what is that smell? Oh. Raven's blood. Nightshade and mandrake. A vampire delicacy from Romania. They can't resist it. He gets this from your side of the family. Why does he always make fun of me? You're a great kid, Adder. But we just don't understand this fascination with vampires. Well, I'm sorry if I'm not the son that you want me to be. All we want is for you to be happy. And if that means dressing up and carrying around bottles of stinky vampire goo, then go for it. Not till after sunset. Right. Gotta think like a vampire. You know vampires aren't real, don't you? That's what we're here to find out. A cheery spot. Someone should open a window. We never open the curtains. Sunlight damages our antiques. But you do have cable, right? And running water. Perfect. Uh, we booked two rooms. It should be under the name Carbayo. Sign the book, please. And your other guest? He'll be here after sunset. Don't ask. What's this about this town being full of vampires? Old fables, like the Witches of Salem. I wouldn't lose any sleep over it. We heard there was a vampire attack last week. Do you believe in vampires? <laughs> of course not. Neither do I. Neither does anyone else in Wisteria. We've been fighting those rumors for years. It keeps the tourists away. Or in our case, it attracts them. <laughs> Still, people believe what they want to. Speaking for the citizens of Wisteria, we'd appreciate it if you wouldn't spread silly rumors. Memo to self. Don't ask the hotel guy about vampires. He's gonna love Adder. <gasps> I wouldn't fool around in that getup if I were you. Show me to my room. Number 16, up the stairs to the left. I want to see the catacombs. Catacombs? They've been closed for years. Closed? I mean, show me. I understand there's an entrance in the basement of this inn. Hey, is that the way? The catacombs are sealed off. Why are you so interested? Let's just say I have an appointment. Get a look at what attacked you the other night? Too bad. Because somebody just checked in that's making me very nervous. My father looks at me like I were from another world. Perhaps I am. Or should be. The catacombs are sealed, but that won't stop me. Tonight. While everyone sleeps, I will find Dreyfus, if he exists. Yo, Adder, what are you writing? Nothing. <laughs> You're writing something. You just make fun of it, like everything else. Well, hunting vampires is pretty goofy. Let's talk about something else. <laughs> Well, I'm turning in. 
We'll have plenty to talk about tomorrow. Yeah, a real yak fest. Sure, he's the one who jumped me. Why else would he be coming down here? We got him all right. really here. Don't move, you devil! I thought we saw the last of your kind ages ago! My kind? What do you... Hey, whoa, whoa. I'm not a vampire. Vampire. 
I'm a vampire hunter. Look at him. He looks like a vampire. Don't you Stay dead! Stay dead! <laughs> Came up through here. That's how he nearly got you the other night. He can't be far. Let's split up. Got you now. He wasn't in the. It's okay. He can't get away. Wait. I swear I'm not a vampire. My name is Adder Carbio. My parents are staying at your inn. You vampires are all the same. Real brave until you're about to get staked. No, look. Where would you? Kissy. Hello. Don't let him fool you. Why don't you rats leave our town alone? But I'm a kid. I go to Westport High, ninth grade. This, this, it's just an act. So, so. So what? So I can pretend. I wanted to see if vampires are real. And they are. I found one. So did we. And we're gonna send you back where you came from. <laughs> Shade and Mandrake, all the way from Romania. Just for you. Better than blood, isn't it? And you, you haven't eaten in a long, long time. Come and get it. Save my life. Um, yeah, I guess I did. So, it was Dreyfus all along. I never thought I'd find him. It was all just a dumb game. Oh, it's not a game here, son. There are dozens of vampires buried down below. We don't usually have problems, but uh, every so often. So, this really is vampire town. I'm, uh, I'm sorry, kid. If there's anything I can do to make it up to you. Actually, there is. You can tell that hotel guy that I'm not really a vampire. Stanley? <laughs> that little weasel ran away, didn't he? Yeah. He really is kind of a weenie. <laughs> This place is 
wasn't so bad after all. And today's gonna be about Adder, right? Adder? Yes, Adder. Our Adder? Adder? Hey guys, how'd you sleep? Terrific. You feeling okay? I couldn't be better. Good. You ready to go check out those catacombs? You'd really go with me? Oh, it's a little weird, but if you're into it, who am I to judge? Well, thanks a lot, Dad. But they're closed. Really? Ah, oh, gee. Too bad. So, let's do something else. <laughs> um, I thought maybe we could use those jet tickets. You're kidding. You want to go to the game? But what about the vampire hunt? <sighs> I came. I saw. It's over. You sure? Positive. Well, let's hit it. We'll make it in time for kickoff. I'll be right there. Hello? Hello, Adder. Hey, thanks for not saying anything to my parents about last night. I don't think they'd understand. I'll never breathe a word. In case you run into any more vampires. How kind. Well, bye. Oh, you know, there's something that I don't get. If Dreyfus only rose last night, then who attacked Mr. Mueller last week? I was hoping people would think it was you. Yeah, but we, uh... Wait. What do you mean, hoping? It's getting harder and harder to get by undetected. I hope you like Vampire Town, because you'll be staying here a long, long time. And that's the end. That was, good. That was cool. Great story. Well, meeting's over. We're out of here. I'm sorry, Quinn. It wasn't fair to think you started the fight. It's okay. Yeah, me too, dude. I wasn't thinking. Don't worry about it. All right. See ya. So, who did start the fight? I did. But hey, the guy deserved it. He nabbed my lunch. Yeah, I kind of figured. That's because you're a smart guy, just like me. Uh, 